Here we are looking at the ArcGIS indoor web viewer of a building on a university campus. The floor pick widget allows me to easily view and transition between floors. As I zoom in, I can see the room numbers displayed and point of interest. And as I zoom in even more, I can see the room details. I can click on a room to view its information, and I can click on a particular asset to see its attribute information, including asset ID, make, model, and access outside data source information like an operations manual. I can associate a picture with it and launch a survey123 work order form directly from that asset. Here my location can be collected, use the smart forms to answer any questions, and directly bring in information from the assets attribute table directly into the form, like building and floor, room number, and asset ID. Additionally, you can view each individual floor in 3D. The floor pick widget functions the same in both 2D and 3D, and you can view the entire model as a whole. You can query for any room or asset information that is within the attribute table, for example, asset ID. You will be taken directly to that asset or room's location and can click on it to view the associated attributes. You can create dynamic dashboards for reporting services where the ArcGIS indoor viewer is embedded. For example, a dashboard reporting on all work orders in the facility or campus. You can view them on each individual floor in the work orders by type or criticality. How many work orders are there? How many are assigned or unassigned? I can select a criticality level and view the statistics associated with that criticality. Additionally, I have a dropdown of all the work orders for that criticality. I can select one and be taken directly to its location and view the work order information and associated attributes. In this safety and security dashboard, I can bring in a live camera feed of those specific areas, as well as other real-time information. All of this information can be distributed on a mobile device through the ArcGIS Indoors application. It will have a lot of the same functionality as the web viewer, including the floor pick widget and the zoom functionality with various map elements being displayed. As I zoom in, I can select the asset to view the associated attribute information. I can launch into the same Survey123 work order as I did from the web viewer. I can easily complete this form in the field with auto-populating certain fields from the information that resides in the attribute table and through easy-to-use drop-down options. I can submit that form when completed back to the GEO database. I have a direction widget that allows me to navigate to that asset from another room or building with a solid blue line for when I have that floor selected and a dashed one for having a different floor selected. Additionally, I can view the turn-by-turn -turn directions.